Today I will show you how to revive a dead 18 650 lithium ion battery cells or any lithium ion battery cells for that matter. Let's get started. So I have these 18 650 cells that are way over discharged. The voltage of the cell is about only half a volt. And if I put in my charger, it doesn't want to charge. For good cells, usually when they put in the charger, the light will turn red indicating that it's charging the battery. But this cell just doesn't want to charge, stays green. The light stays green. I even tried it with my Tonergy RC charger and it still doesn't want to charge, says so low voltage. So basically the battery voltage here is way too low for this charger to uh, recognize the battery and charge the battery. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use another good cell here. This cell is uh, fully charged. See there, 4.09 volts. And I'm going to con connect the cells in parallel. Positive. Hook up to the positive. I'm using the magnet so it will stick on to my alligator clip. And the negative terminal. Connecting to the negative terminal. Right. This is parallel charging. I'm going to let it charge for a few moments. Maybe about 20 seconds or so. 20 or 30 seconds until it gets to see it's already getting to 3.2 volts quickly and it quickly rise and uh, I'm just gonna let it charge for like another 10 seconds or so um, let's see what we got right now and you don't have to do this long at all <coughs> uh, the point is to raise the voltage just enough for the for the charger to recognize the battery and I think it should be good right now so let's unplug this and let's see what's the voltage right now 3.26 volts okay should be good I get the magnet out and try to put in my charger. The battery does get a bit warm, which is normal. Uh, you don't want to do this for too long. I think on average 30 seconds should be good enough. There we go, it's charging. The light turns red, so indicating it's charging. Now let me try it on my uh, Eternity charger. See if it makes a difference here. Negative, positive. Right. Start. There we go. It's charging. It's at three over three volts now. So. It's charging. And this method is not just limited to uh, 18650 lithium ion cells. It works with any lithium ion cells, like other kinds of lithium ion cells, LiPo RC car batteries, LiPo batteries, cell phone battery, any lithium ion cells. Alright, that's all I have for now. Next video, I'm going to show you how to salvage these cells from Makita Power Tool batteries. And these are really good cell, high discharge cell. Until next time, thanks for watching.